Speaking of all this, Final Fantasy VI, how about that? So, alright, welcome to the stream. Last time we did the Phoenix Cave, Grape Robber is now finally back in our party. And yeah, that's right, I didn't even check uh, what was the patch notes, like, hold on a second. It literally just came out as I was about to start streaming, so hey, we might as well uh, have a quick look. Alright, content of the, the thing. But, oh my, this is, this is big as fuck, what the fuck? Okay, change it so that an Esper can be reused immediately if, if cancelled during summoning. An item not consumed if the action of using it is cancelled before use. Oh, MP or not consumed when using enemy abilities with sketch. Change it so that when a specific status effect is applied to a character from using rage, the effect is not applied if that character is wearing equipment preventing the effect. Change the default position of the cursor when using an item to throw with the throw ability. Change it so that only inapplicable elemental vulnerabilities applied when using the debilitator. What? What the hell does that mean? Could that mean that somehow you will be able to actually have, like, you know, physical uh, vulnerability with the debilitator? Change it so that the uh, golem can defend against enemy abilities that simultaneously make physical attack and inflict status effect. Change it so that quick and terror's trance and revert cannot be used while affected by confusion. Change it so that a character can attack the opposing side when affected by both confusion and entice. Ah, oh, okay, that's good. Change it so that all allied characters are treated as being in the front rank when surrounded. Ah, oh, okay. What the heck? Oh, change it so that it is possible to return to the previous map from the way shoot in the Magitech factory. Change it so that characters are correctly healed up to full uh, health after specific event. Oh! You should change it so there's a side street. Eh, uh, yeah. Let me, right now I kind of was uh, carried away. I'm just uh, reading uh, <laughs> bug fixes right now just because. The wiki. No, it's, there literally was a patch that just dropped as I was about to stream. Oh. So yeah, battles will occasionally not progress under specific circumstances. Some enemies will act unnaturally under specific circumstances. Characters will sometimes act unnaturally when using auto battle. Sometimes rays will not trigger. Wow. Sometimes other allies and enemies will cease to act when rage was used by a character affected by quick. Sometimes unsuitable behavior will arise when the curse shield was equipped by a character affected by quick. Under specific circumstances, a character will sometimes stay airborne and not come down when using quit quit sell quit selly. What? Now uh, that's an esper that makes it so that all of your party does a jump attack all at once. And apparently, before this patch, uh, if you d use this Esper, some of your characters somehow will never come back down. <gasps> Damage modifier from being in the front or rear rank of the party will be applied to the second and subsequent hit of the Bushido technique, Flurry and Tempest. Ah, so that's why the damage was fucked up. Was unable to oh was able to learn reflect interrogation mark and white wind that do not function correctly when using control. Was unable to escape from battle when successfully using control. After dance was ended by the character entering the confused state, dance will subsequently always miss. Sometimes the ATB gauge will not be used up properly. Sometimes the message couldn't steal was shown when trying to steal from the same enemy again after stealing an item. Whoops, okay. <laughs> Some attacks are able to target all enemies on both the left and right when surrounded in battle. We will continue to work to address this issue. Some attacks are able to target... Okay, sometimes players will receive more drop items. Gill and experience point when killing an enemy when the inst with the instant death effect from weapon. 
The ability of the weapon Falchion and Murasame to stop enemy attacks was not triggering properly. Wait, what? Oh, the effect of uh, sometimes cover will work, sometimes the ATB gauge will reset, or the additional effect of weapon will not trigger correctly when making consecutive attack using the counter attack effect from the Black Belt Relic. Ah, god damn it! I almost wish I did that better, faster. It was possible to escape from some battle where escape should not be possible, such as the Cultist Tower. Fuck. Fucked up. Oh yeah, also for some reason you're really quiet right now. Am I? Yep. Uh, you're at 100%. I mean, yeah, don't get me wrong. That's the intended, uh, that's the intended uh, way that the uh, Fanatic Tower worked, but oh god. All right, that should be a little louder now. Okay, like, there we it, go. It's at, now it's you're, at full volume. Yeah, now you're perfectly fine. Good, Was good. possible to avoid being surrounded using the ability of the alarm hearing in some battle where the player should always be surrounded. Oh, okay. But at this point, I wonder, can you use the alarm hearing to prevent surround attack in Dinosaur Forest? That's one thing that I wonder if they change or not. Hmm. But yeah, at this point I'm not even reading everything because hey, there's still like a million of other patch notes. Level and event sometimes was difficult to progress forward on the world map when riding a chocobo. What? What? Oh, sometimes Go's level will increase after he recovered from using Lee. Okay. I don't know what any of this means. Yikes, this game is still really fucking buggy, what the hell? But yeah, alarm hearing is supposed to prevent back attack and pincer attack, but... There are some attacks which are scripted to happen no matter what. And I know for sure the alarm hearing does not allow you to uh, not actually... Uh, ward off like a counter or a pincer attack from uh... oh my god he has so much hp what the fuck i mean at that point i might as well just bring helm just because she's literally my best magic user but who else is coming along to narsh mm. ah might as well go with the Let's go with Beefy McJones. Yeah, it's probably because they have the uh, the red cap equip. Like at this point, let's unequip everybody else. Oh yeah, that's right. I need to bring fucking uh, Mog along. Oh well. Like at that point, uh, we might as well just uh, do the thing. Okay, wing edge, tiger. Okay. Falchion. Okay. Ah, Thief's Bracer. And what's the other one that I want? Ah, Priyan Glove. Alright. Ah, okay, she still has the experiencing. I mean, I might as well just keep it. Why not? Ba -ba -da -ba -dum. Okay, at this point, he already mastered Fire Row. That's all I'm asking for literally anybody who's coming along on this journey. Okay, everybody can use Fire. Perfect. But yeah, that's right, I kind of forgot, I need to bring uh, Mog alongside with me. Well, this sucks the balls. Oh, haven't we met someplace before? Yeah, I saw you plummet to your death. Fucked up. 
doors are all locked and you'd have to be some kind of treasure hunter to get them open. Mm. Oh, Death Rider. Also, no, I still haven't seen that. Uh, I still haven't seen the uh, Doom Gaze yet. I don't know where the fuck he is, but hey, he's somewhere waiting. I mean, woof. Because hey, normally all of those doors are locked. But now we can actually open them. But of course, for the majority of the places, it doesn't really do anything because this entire town is a ghost town now. But there's a couple of doors that you want that to open up. As well than a bunch of doors. Alright, whatever, let's say. Oh. Oh, yay! Stole potion! Fuck yeah! Alright, let's steal the Memwood. He's gotta have something worthwhile. Uh, wait, what did I steal? I didn't see it. I also didn't see it. Ah, with that said, you get fucking nothing from these encounters. But yeah, there's a couple of buildings over here that you... Yeah, that you want to check out if at some point we're allowed to actually uh, go and check them out. Uh. Right. I mean, he's probably not even gonna survive this, but hey. Uh, yep. <gasps> Libre. Because, yeah, you can pay a hundred thousand dollars in the world to actually, you know, have info that uh, there's a guy that still waits for you in the weapon store. And here he is. Yep, I ran a weapon shop for 70 years, but I've never felt a power like the one I feel in this stone. I were to grind it down in the shape of a blade, I'm sure we'll make a very powerful weapon. What do you say? Oh, I mean, I might as well do a, do a poll out of this. So. Alright, one moment. Uh, I feel like this is a decision that's uh, worthy enough. Uh... Oh, whoops. Okay, new poll. Okay, make us. Okay, all right. We're just gonna have this guy going for one minute. So there's a poll. So do we keep uh, the said? Uh, so do we keep the magicite Ragnarok as a magicite, or do we make it into a sword? Because uh, sword, sword, sword. Because hey, the sword is actually really fucking powerful. But uh, the Esper is also kind of powerful. I mean, the Esper itself sucks, but you get to learn uh, Ultima whenever you have it equipped. So, hey. I mean, both are uh, kind of a one of a kind, so I'd say, huh? No matter what you get, uh, you're definitely getting your word. Yeah, Ragnarok can be traded for Illumino, which is busted. Ah, with that said, uh, Ultimo definitely got a whole bunch of votes. Alright. So yay, Ooh. Ultimo won, so we get to keep it as a Magicite. Alright. I can't believe you people. I mean, we're still having out of this the strongest pill in the entire game, so it's not as if you're getting you're getting nothing out of it. All right. I know, but I magic guess, sword. I guess Tero's gonna learn uh, Ultimo. Uh, okay, where was the other thing? I never remember what's the right house. Cause there's something else to find into this place. All right. Oh, revenge! Oh, pfft. 
Also, I swear that revenge is still busted. It's just like, uh, what the fuck? There we go, the slowest of all games. And I can't think that this is it. No, oh, it's just the Elder's house. There is absolutely nothing of worth. Oh, yay, back attack. Yeah, Illumino always hits, as reach, MP crits, battle power 255, 50% magic, and physical evade. Yeah, it's like, hey, we'll still manage just fine without, uh, without Ragnarok and uh, Illumino, but, uh, yeah, we're still missing out on one hell of a sword. Seems pretty good. You should have picked the sword. Yep, but Hellas, the people have decided otherwise. Why do I have 84 TikTok notifications? What happened? You, uh... TikTok, yo! Yep. <laughs> That's why! <laughs> oh, apparently people actually found the ranch TikTok. Good. Oh, yeah. yeah. That's the right house. Alright, take it. The curse shield. If only there were a way to lift the curse, it would be the finest shield in the world. Now the question is, do I actually bother on cursing the shield? I have a feeling if I do this, it's gonna be off camera. <laughs> Or 12 hour marathon. Because, uh, yeah, in order to uh, uncurse a shield for the people who uh, do not know, you have to win a hundred fights with it. So, 12 hour marathon. <laughs> I mean, not 12 hours, but it's still really fucking long. Yeah, Ragnarok through skill is not teaching you Ultima, but the <laughs> shenanigans of Metamorph. It looks like you've oh, thank you, Kushabat, for the sub. Thank you very much. Oh, bug. All right, we might as well just uh, go in there, uh, do the, tr the test drive of uh, Metamorph. Oh, it's 255 battles. Okay, all right. And it took us too long to actually, you know, uh, get the Metamorph. Magnoroder and son of Magnoroder. Okay, all right. Now it's totally the time. So yeah, this uh, thing turns an enemy into an item. If it works, of course, and it didn't. Oh, lightning scroll. Oh, Twitch.tv learn Curago. All right, and there we go. Now Twitch.tv is the perfect healer. At this point, do I bother to teaching her holy? Might as well. Now, I think it's always been the same. It's just uh, getting this thing to be done just takes fucking forever, which is why uh, typically I don't do it if I just do a casual playthrough. Ah, oh, okay. I guess he can just solo these encounters. Oh, wizard. Wizard. The fuck kind of wizard is that? Eh, uh, the squishy kind. Oh, Thunder Let's Rod. See. I mean, Hero Shield is an uh, overkill, but hey, it's still fun. Nah, Wizard Man, you got your ass kicked. Oh, Psychos! Alright. Psychodelic Eyeball. It's time to attack the Psychopaths. 
Ah, uh, oops, that's fine. Also, I forgot to once again uh, use Metamorph. I'm just like, uh, even the uh, beefy McJones at his shitty ass level can still pretty much solo all these encounters. Why are we here then? Now nah, we're here to go get a party member. And then. Uh, oh, Osmos! I mean, considering the amount of things that are bugged in this version of the game. I'm almost willing to say that, hey, it uh, doesn't do anything, <laughs> that a ripple is probably still bugged, so hey. <laughs> so yeah, all the Moogles are dead, except for one. And we're gonna kill them too. Oh. There we go. I'm so glad you're alive, Koopo. I'll help you fight, Koopo. No. Let the Yidil come along too, he'll be a big help. Yep, he'll help us if I order him too. There we go, Molulu Charm and Achievement Unlock, Looking for Friend, Volume 3. Alright, at this point, let's try again. Uh, okay, uh, oh, silence! Oh, alright, this time it worked. Oh, I dubbed the gold needle! Uh, ah, no, fuck. Okay, at least Hasp is actually faster in this version of the game. But yeah, every enemy in this game can be turned into another item. But uh, yeah, the chances of it happening are not the highest. And finally, yeah, it's kind of a niche thing. But hey, let's try it some more. All right, psychos. Oh, all right. All right, I dug the antidote. <laughs> Oh, stole ice rod! Okay, they have two different kind of rods to steal. Too bad that rods in this game are not as powerful as they were in 5. Oh yeah, that's right, I never got the chests in there. I need to actually go get them. Uh -huh. For some reason, I keep picking the, the wrong spill. No, every enemy just turns into a potion. It's real fun. There you go, elixir. Or, or that. Oh, guard bracelet. All right, it's totally worth to uh, skip on these chests then. Uh, oh god, <laughs> poor wizard got fucked up. Ah, okay. At least these guys give magic points. Nah, that's okay. It was his unpopular cousin, Wizard Guy. Wizard Dude. Wizard Dude today. Uh, enemies that can make Ribbon, Misty, Pandora, Coco, Level 80 Magic, and Cherry. Hauling out. Oh, enemies that can make Groteg, Marchosias, Galliped, Vesig. What the fuck is this? <gasps> no, I swear this enemy name has just been made up. Yep, there we go. The test was. The test was inconclusive. He sucked. 
Oh no, back attack. How am I gonna survive? Uh, Samurai and Yujimbo can turn into Genji Glove. Alright, now we need to actually make room for one person. Oh, uh, yep. The treasure hunter the has. Dog? Yep. You gotta, no. come... you gotta come along because otherwise we're not getting the next party member. So, how is he like? Okay, pretty decent. I like guess stats still suck, but hey, that's uh, nothing that leveling up can fix. Now, I, th I think uh, if you keep bet, if you bet uh, more uh, Ichigeki or whatever the name of the weapon is. In the other encounter, if you try to bid it again, it's just gonna summon Shupo in order to, uh, you know. Oh, if you want Megalixir, you have to use on Metamorph on Intangir. Hey, at least the option's there. Oh, uh, that said, does... Oh, yeah. <gasps> Hold on a second. Mog needs a weapon, because right now he's got fucking nothing. <gasps> No, that seems like the natural state of it. You should let him go. See I'm what not, happens. I'm not letting him be fucking useless. Just see, just see what happens. You, no! Maybe he, gets, maybe he gets thrown into a pit. Who knows? Because if I keep him with this weaponry, I might as well just, you know, uh, make him dance all of the time. There you go. See, that's what, that's what, they're, that's what they do. All right. That's, uh, now at least he's got a spear. A she won, but hey, better than nothing. Also, sorry, the Mughal charm is for us, for wimps. Okay, now. Uh, can Mug ever equip something better? It's like, I unfortunately don't remember where you find a spare snow muffler. Because if you get him one of these, then uh, he's gonna fucking rule the butt. Rule the butt? Alright, I might as well make him uh, the good old uh, jumping moogle. I feel like that's the natural thing to do with him. Okay, that said, I have to teach him fire, because otherwise he's gonna be worthless. Oh, yeah, that's why. Um, I really want to teach him Phoenix, however. Oh, but Fire Ego. Ah, Colosseum Behemoth Suit. Okay, so I need to go get another Behemoth Suit. Oh yeah, that's right. I, I don't remember if I said this before, but uh, yeah, my Discord can now be uh, openly joined up. Just click on that good old link that is in the chat now. Wanna become famous? Yep. Okay, I've joined the Discord. How do I become famous? <laughs> I mean, that's all you have to do. Oh, shit. That's the only... Uh, that's I've the been famous! For years! <laughs> I mean, the other way that I can get a Behemoth suit is, of course, to just go and, uh, to just go and fight, uh, just go and fight, uh, a, be uh, a senior Behemoth into the, the veld.
Yeah, and beside the dragon, them fucking suck. Like, I, I'm not gonna miss any of the GBA only dungeon. They, they were both bad. <gasps> Okay, Gingy Helm, Crystal Shield, Crystal Mail. And yeah, by the way, that's exactly what the uh, famous postmen want to have. That's how they became famous. Wait, I thought that they fixed the ranks into uh... a. Um, Oh no, damn you when you're heavied. But yeah, with Trump and the Dragon Horn, at least a mug can actually deal okay damage. But he's kind of gonna become a. Uh... Palish uh, whenever he's got. Oh, that's right. Does he have any healing? Oh, that's right. Mug right now has no fucking spells whatsoever. Yeah, right now Mug kind of sucks. <laughs> <laughs> Twilight Requiem. Sorry, but uh, Mog stats kind of bite, which is why I don't like him the best. Like, he kind of... It's like most of his appeal is that typically when he joins your party the first time, he actually will have way more levels than everybody, but to compensate, unfortunately, he's also by far your weakest character, stats-wise. Like, his stats are all pretty damn bad. Sounds like a terrible trade-off. It's like, yeah, let's just, let's just go and check out his stats here. 29 strength, 36 agility, 26 stamina, 35 magic. I mean, at least his magic stat is sort of okay. FF5 Geomaster, but once he starts dancing, he never stops. Thank you, uh, Seraphic Cat, for the sub. Thank you very much. Oh, yeah, and also, Geo doesn't. Uh, Geomaster doesn't miss as opposed to dance. Like, I feel like I'm uh, setting myself up to even more arguments to ditch him by the second. Like, he might legit be on my list of uh, people that I'm going to keep on the airship at the end of the game. Oh, and there we go, now we get to his final dance! Ah, fuck. Fuck you and your rasp! There we go, learn fire, snowman rondo. Oh yeah, that's right, we still get the free healing bucket. <gasps> I'm so glad that the bucket survived the end of the world. Ah, 
I mean, people already kind of do like these challenge runs where uh, people just beat the whole game with uh, Celeste, uh, Setzer, and Edgar because they're like the only character in the world of Ruin which are required to finish the game. So, hey, the actual part, uh, party uh, of every single group is just gonna be these two. So, no solo Mog runs? I mean, you could do one if you really wanted to. I mean, I'm not gonna do it. I'm saying you can do the solo one. Why would I be the one to do it? Because I'm not doing it, I don't know. I'm not doing it either. I'm doing it even less than you. And I own the game. All right. There you go, Ice Dragon. Oh, okay. Good thing that he learned fire in the right nick of time. <laughs> there we go. Mug is finally useful. Uh -oh. Trancing on that. Uh, ah, fuck. Oh, that's right, I should have done a full heal considering that hey, my magic powers right now are boosted. Yep. <laughs> yeah, it turns out that morphing in an Esper is kind of overpowered. There we go, Fire Rot on Daryl. And for shield. Five dragons left. And yet, yeah, the, it's the pixel remaster available now on your phone as well in PC. And there we go, we're back to the good old uh, back attack club. Uh, oh, ah, oh, that's right. It's like the spell is so impressive looking, but then all it does is literally just, oh, uh, it steals MP. Basic attacks. These things are too chumpy to care. <laughs> yeah, I mean, that's kind of the danger whenever your game shift to a non linear style. You can't really, you know, make uh, all of the content uh, consistent difficulty wise. Alright, Valigarmando. AKA the most well named. Uh, Rechange of uh, person. Ah, okay. Now Mug actually does have fire. Good.
Okay, so I'm sorry, but you kind of suck. If your highest possible attack, uh, ice base attack, only deals uh, this little damage. All right, goodbye. So much for the mighty game-changing Esper. Fire Ego and Holy. Oh, I suppose that's of little consequence. Oh, what is this? What of this devastation that fills the air? There we go. We got a big burb. And we get to see uh, some more progress. Oh yeah, that's right. Tritok, where, where's the f where the frick is Tritok? Ah, that's right. Valley Garmada. Wabudu budu budu budu. Like I'm sorry, but I maintain my opinion on saying this name fucking suck. Give me back Tritok. As you see, it's close to TikTok, and therefore it's hip for the kids. I don't care that I'm out of touch with the kids. All right, there's an open, uh, wait, wait, hold on, did they really ask me that? Oh, okay, here's another bug. There's an opening in the cliff, up into it. There's an opening in the cliff, up into it. Oh, Ilyanko, what the fuck are these enemy names? Like, I remember the enemy names in this cave being particularly bad, but wow, what the fuck is this? Zach Mekiel! Alright, two green cherries. Alright, now it's time to suffer like a fucker. Like, I'm not 100% certain on how to uh, get through this encounter yet. Ah, Ultimo is still only at 63%. Yeah, this is... Alright, whatever. It's time to hop into it. Alright, come on, Tonberries. Ah, God! <laughs> Fucking hell! <laughs> like, wait, hold on. Do I have protect? Uh, Fuckers hurt so hard. Alright, hold well, on. Do holy work okay against these? I guess we're gonna see. First, let's check out. Ah, that's right. Also, these things have uh, evade up the ass. Okay. Ah, fuck! <laughs> okay, thank goodness. Uh-oh. 
Counter holy. I'm still hoping it's not. Well, okay. The mighty holy spell. Oh, it only deals 300 damage as opposed to our knife attack of our fucking fish like faces of fuck. Oh, nice! Fuck him up, Mug! <laughs> the Boogie Woogie is strong tonight! Ah, we didn't get the fucking Minerva busts here, so alright, time to reload. Okay, configuration, uh, return to title screen. We have to redo this fight because hey, they didn't drop their item because they only have a slight chance to drop it. Otherwise, all you get out of this fight is five freaking magic points. But hey, at the very least, now we know what, uh, how to do it. I mean, it's either I do that now, or I do this fight in order to have it being put on the veld, and then I beat the fight again there in order to try and get the, the thing. Yeah, it's not guaranteed, because there's three of them, you see? Right, let's jump into the yeah, even in death, the Tonberry will. Oh Knotty! Oh yeah, also the fun thing with this dungeon, literally every enemy in here can turn you into an imp, so yeah, it kinda sucks. Yep, there we go. <laughs> As advertised! There we go, one green cherry. At least all the encounters in here give green cherries. So that's like the one saving grace. Okay. Uh, oh no! I, I cast the wrong spell! <laughs> God damn it! <laughs> oh my fuck! Whoops! I didn't want to cast Berserk, that was a tactical error! I wanted to cast Protect, I don't know how the fuck I did such a mistake! Tom Berry's infuriate him. <gasps> ah, what the fuck? What, do you have a, oh, all right, haste. How about we put TikTok you on haste so that we can try and get one or two holies out before we run out of meter.
Wait, hold on. Let's try and sketch them just to see if these guys are sketchy. <laughs> Alright, the very least one of them is the... Ah, miss. Alright, come on, quick, 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 before... Uh... Ah, crap. Ran out of time. What was the pun? I don't even know. What have I said? What's happened? All right, still nothing. We. All right, we gotta fight Tonberry again. Come on, it can't have been that bad. And... Action. For some reason, whenever you load the game and you're using a gamepad, you can't start moving until at least, like, five seconds. Flame Rod. Uh, ah, fuck. Like, I keep forgetting that it has you to question twice. Alright, come on, give me my Minerva Bustier. That's only like the, the best uh, armor for a shitload of characters in the game. Uh, ah, uh, oops. Alright, whatever. I've invested with the... Ah, uh, that's right. Vanish is gonna be fucking useless, given that I'm gonna have to heal her at some point. Yep. That was dumb of my part. I see I missed an enormous amount. Yeah, we're right now we're currently redoing this fun fight because hey, there's a certain drop that we want uh, from this fight and it's not guaranteed and you can only have it once. That's just good. What game a good design. video game. Hashtag good game. Celebrate good games. Come on. I celebrate good games by playing Barney's Hide and Seek. As well, then, uh, I don't know, uh, Guy McFucko in the Shit Factory. I don't, I don't know that one. Uh, it's, it's brand new. One of them Canada only releases. Oh, nice! Fucking kill two of these jerks! Like Mug is proving his worth more and more with every refight of this. Minerva Bastier, there we go. All right. Okay. So 
All right, there we go. That's why I wanted this armor. Look at the fucking stat upgrade ah. that this gives you. That does seem pretty good. Yes. Yep. It's like it, it is end game armor material. Makes beef mix. <laughs> Why are we talking about Sebin's tits? He's just muscle. He's muscle man. Uh, Etc. Oh, Knotty. Ah, fuck. Ah, okay, thank you! <laughs> oh, what a surprise. Sketching these make them cast him. How about that? Yep, I downloaded a custom font uh, from online in order to uh, replace it as the font of this. And therefore, everything looks a whole lot better now. Friend maker. Oh, I thought one of the monsters was named Friend Maker. No, that's just his name. That, that's just the name of the attack for some reason. And I'm pretty certain that attack turns you into an imp. Because that's literally the theme of this whole freaking dungeon. I'd love to see some guy just named Friend Maker walk up to you and then you beat the shit out of him like a dickhead. <laughs> I want to be your friend. Oh! I want to be your friend. <laughs> I'll beat you up, you fucker. What was that voice? It's my friend maker voice. <laughs> Mickey Mouse? Yeah. Alright. Yeah, it's me, friend Johnson. Be my friend. Oh, yeah, that's right. <laughs> oh, Onion Dasher. Oh, <laughs> Okay! <laughs> uh, that's real cool! <laughs> I agree, it is real cool. It's just they're casting, uh, they're casting magic on themselves in order to heal themselves. Alright, that's, the that's the real challenge for you here, Psych. Okay. Can you say an enemy anemone three anem times fast? An enemy anemone, an enemy anemone, an enemy <laughs> You could have just said no. I mean, I have to try. <laughs> ah, there we go, Magicite. Oh, Midgar Sorm. Midgar what? The Esper name was just Midgar Sorm. <laughs> there we go, Yeti. All right, face the wrath of God, Yeti. Be at ease with your superiors. Green cherry. Yeah, energize. Defense increase. Magic defense increase. Speed increase. Healing increase. Butt increase. Oh, he gets regen now. Oh, <laughs> What you, get for, what you get for making fun of him? Yep, 10 years.
There we go. I'm your boss, Kupu. You're gonna join us, Kupu. Yeah, there we go. A yeti with a love for bone carving. Stronger than a guy, guess, but a bit unruly. Alright, what's his name? <laughs> Alright. There we go. After use worm, here's use Yeti. Mm, me use Yeti. Yes, boss, me join you. Why though? I mean, he's clearly not a worm. Didn't he you make me the didn't you make me the Yeti last time too? I don't know. I'm I don't remember. Sure you, I'm pretty sure you made me use Yeti last time you played this, you son of a bitch. No, I called you Useworm. Now you're Use Yeti. You've evolved. You still made me the fucking Yeti. I mean, he's kind of cool. He sucks, but he's cool. <laughs> okay, it is me then. Cool. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, you're not missing much. The Yeti is kind of there. But I will bring him along for the incoming excursion because hey, that's like his one chance to count to, to shine. Oh, you have high evade, you fuck All right, whatever. I'm just waiting for this thing to be impaled. Unless that I can sketch you on. No, never mind. Like, wait, why did the damage suddenly decrease with jump? Like, is there somehow a bug that makes it so that jump deals half damage in the back row after the first jump? Is that something else that uh, they also need to fix? It's like, I'm kind of impressed to see how much of a mess this really is, is so far. Oh, Yitzy Gaga. <laughs> but I'm not the Lady Gaga fan. I can call uh, Umaro Yitzy Gaga. You can do whatever the fuck you want. Right. You're not a TikTok fan. You still called one of them TikTok. No, that's because I wanted to name your characters just like you. Alright, Kurego Harais. Oh yeah, that's right, I could have called uh, the Yeti Smash Cast. Oh, that's fine. Might as well heal everybody before we leave. Ah, oh, fuck off! <laughs> I want to say goodbye. All right, it's time for the raging boomer. <laughs> oh, heavy lance. Is that better than? Wow, this fucking sucks. What the hell is this? <laughs> All right, so now... this point, we're literally only missing one character, but I'd say before doing it, I might as well do another dungeon that uh, doesn't uh, involve getting a character. Oh, okay, yeah, at that point, uh, the friend achievement means you got everybody in your party back. Because now the only person we're missing is the final party member of the game. Hey, okay, hey, go, go. All right, so now who gets to come? All right, Yiddy. It's like the one chance that he has to shine. And who the hell? All right. It's like it's a random-ass assortment of characters, but uh, hey... 
I'm bringing the old man along because, hey, he has a chance to actually learn a bunch of lores where we're going. And everybody else is coming because the enemies are weak at to a physical shit. So my time has come. Great. Yep. There we go. Berserker ring. Do we have the other thing? Like, I know he has another relic, but I'm not sure if I have acquired it yet. I never remember when you get it. Uh, Alright. Alright, Sniper Eye. Because, uh, unfortunately, the bad thing with the Yeti is he can't equip uh, any magic. But, uh, oh yeah, that's right. What is this again? A uh, Quake Graviga Tornado. Oh yeah, the Blizzard Orb. Valvoline, the, the, the thing of the devil, I don't know. Okay. He still hasn't finished learning that. Ah, that's right. I'm sorry, I'm not the one who chose on the shitty naming scheme. Info in the game itself telling you what? Oh, that's right. Oh, so I've shared with my party. Might as well try to get more nightmares. Oh, maybe they'd return if a loved one went and pleaded with them. Oh no, I'm old like uh, like fucking bleach. I don't know. Fucko Jones is simply unbelievable. First the nurse, then me. The man hits on anything that moves. But yeah, the reason why we're into this castle... It's like, uh, there's absolutely no uh, telegraphing it, but hey, whenever you go back to Figaro... Oh, <laughs> what does FFTA2 stands for? Final Fantasy Tetsenas 2. Oh, the stratum's unusually rough. We seem to be catching on something. Alright, stop here. I think we all know who really deserves to be locked here. Yeah, there you go. Cave to the ancient castle. Oh, Figaro Devil. Uh, oh, God! Okay, these monsters are really fucking hard. This might have been a mistake. Alright, whatever they go. They gotta be high level someday. Oh. <laughs> oh my god, that throw was so pathetic. Everything looked fine to me. You're what was that supposed to do? 9999? Nine, 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 nine. What? Oh, 5 EP! Okay, you get a shitload of magic points here. Alright, monster in a box. Alright, 
Master Tonberry. More like Master Titsberry. Look at the tits on that. <laughs> <laughs> Traveler. Ouch. Uh, wait, can I? Ah, oh, yeah, that's right, this fucker, those barrier, barrier change. Good thing I'm just using physical attacks. Oh. Now, at this point, I might as well just get the whole guy uh, for healing two weeks. Especially if he's gonna pull shit like this. Alright, whatever. This is the anti-magic squad. I might as well... Oh, whatever. <laughs> Alright, this bunch of losers somehow managed to beat the, the, the Tonberry. There we go. Learn Traveler! And Gladius. Wing Edge. Oh, fancy. They had it in light effects. There's light shining through the wall. Ooh. Ah, yes, these things are not undead. So therefore I can insta kill. <gasps> <laughs> <laughs> That's the sound of it dying. Yeah. There you go, Bioinosmos. Oh, Death Taro! I can insta kill my guts. <laughs> Oh, that's fine. I shall just try and see if Cleave works on uh, on these uh, on these bozos. Ouch! <laughs> that hurt. That really fucking hurt. Figalis, Figaro Lizard. So I like that these things are just called Devil. Yep, it's the Devil. <laughs> I mean, he still charges, but the thing is, he's now charging behind the scenes, which makes him uh, infinitely more usable now. All right, the point. Let's see if Cleave actually works. Like, I know the Hinuos, at the very least, are gonna be, uh, susceptible to insta-kill. Right. Oh. <laughs> Eat shit. <laughs> Hey, Cyan in this version is actually really good. So maybe the Yeti is really good. Uh, eh? Nah, sadly, eh? nah, sadly eh? not. The big Fuck. problem with the Yeti is that he can never ever improve his stats because he can't equip uh, espers. Okay, at the very least, it's the whole guy who talks about the whole tale, so it's fitting enough. 
Yeah, the Yeti is okay. It's just, uh, oh, it's an Esper attack. Let's lose our Espers. This is the site of a thousand-year-old battle. Lord Hudden is the only Esper left to us as he recovered from his injuries. A city destroyed during the War of the Magi. There we go. Now, the ultimate battle, Odin versus a random ass ghost. Then Tetsuken! <laughs> oh, I never thought you would be able to turn me to stone! I am amazed by what the horrible fate you're uh, endowing to me. Nope, this does not have the GBA editions. There's no Leviathan, no Cactuar, there's a lot of non-things in this version. If you want stuff removed from this version, it's full of it. <laughs> also, there's like no fucking noise to the monster. Uh, <gasps> To, uh, the guy hitting uh, after Umaro throws. Yeah, I mean, yeah, what I meant by that is there's not the Esper. Alright, wait, uh, let's have another healer. Oh, nine into those. Oh, one high potion, only one. At this point, I think I have more regular ass potions than. All right, monster in the box. Samurai soul. Oh God! <laughs> Jesus Christ! This party needed to bring their swimsuits to this party. Oh, okay. That's kind of an underwhelming follow-up to his uh, just regular item throwing. Uh, oh fuck! Here we go again. Oh yeah, at that point the battle plan: keep everybody fully healed at all times. Samurai Soul's power increase! Also, come on. Uh, Speedo is like a minus 10 to a uh, human decency. Oh. Jesus Christ, this guy just cannot make up his mind. Like one second he throws in the most amazing attack, and after that, oh, here's my fart. Oh, great. Uh, wait. Okay. Oh. Wait. Whoa, 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 whoa! The sword technique can now miss. Okay, what the fuck is this? Okay, people uh, who made the game, you fucked something up. Oh god. Alright. 
Time to double tag this fucker. <laughs> Oh god. All right, come on, use worm. You can do it. Beat the boss. <laughs> Wait, what? Wait a minute. Yes, sniper sight on. Why is he missing his attacks? How is this happening? Okay. No, he's not a... Uh, I don't think he... Oh, maybe? Yeah, I'm gonna guess that he put... Those uh, do blink. Okay. So I'm guessing every time he does that, he gets a blink. All right. Alright, come on, Umaru, as long as he doesn't throw water scrolls, uh, you're okay. <laughs> there we go! Use worm MVP! Use worm MVP! Use worm MVP! Yeah, 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 yeah! I missed something, damn it. I missed my I missed my moment in the sun, fuck. Yep! You soloed the boss! <laughs> yeah, eat shit, use my character. <laughs> Yep, everybody died like a shit, except Gesto. Because, hey, the good thing, at least with the Yeti, is he comes with a snow muffler, and that's a really fucking good piece of armor. Like, as you could see, it absorbs lightning, and finally, it also, uh, you know, uh, Ah, that's right. I could have just cleaved him. Oh, great. <laughs> Let's cast if level is divisible by five. Hey, at least we learn another spell. Learn level five death. All right, nothing to revive the dead than a nap. And yeah, the treasure is the Master Scroll. AKA whenever you, it changes fight into rapid fire. Oh, hey, these nerds are back. Ah, shit, sadly he doesn't know him. Oh, but I have a Super Bowl, however. Ah, oh, fuck off, I'm asleep. <laughs> I'm not. Oh, these things are both immune to instant it. Sadly, I, sadly, I do not have a Metamorph equipped right now. Oh, <laughs> Wait, what the hell was that? It was just the the dog of waking up. I am the one who's silent, right? Yeah. Uh, oh yeah, that's one. I am green cherry. Yeah, that's why I have to remember. I must use my big haste in the card. A.K.A. the Super Ball. Oh, Punisher. What the fuck is Punisher? Ah, with that said, uh, there we go. A good ass knife. Ah, but this one does insta dit. Might as well give this to the old man. Put Master Skull on Strago with the heel scroll. Oh, 
Oh, wait, what the fuck is Punisher again? I can't remember. Oh, oh yeah, that's right, that's a holy weapon. Ah, there we go, Cure Hezuna Regen. Yeah, it's like, let's see, what the hell was that? Oh. Okay. Punisher draws MP from its wielder to deal critical hits. There we go, Hudden Crumble is leaving behind a shard of magicite. And hey, at this point it's not even worth equipping it because we're gonna lose it in like 5 seconds. That's not a joke. The Gladius fucking rips. Okay, and these things are still susceptible to instant death. I was so ha I'm so happy I brought Cyan here. <gasps> ah, okay. A armored weapon. Oh yeah, I think this is the only monster in this whole dungeon that. I Oh, fuck! <gasps> he has reflect, fuck me. Because uh. I was like, okay, I'm fairly certain that's like the only enemy in the entire castle area that has some vulnerability to spells. But hey, it doesn't matter if uh, you know he's... Uh... Yep, there we go. <laughs> Insta kill. Yeah, the fun thing, this is the only Esper in the whole game that will increase your speed upon level up, but the bad news is, we're gonna lose him really fucking soon. Ah, there we go, Blizzard Orb, here it is. Here it's Cry. Yeah, absorbs ice and negates fire damage. Equip on a Yeti to see what happens. So I keep forgetting where exactly you get that tip, but uh oh. one treasure chest. Yeah, there we go. Ah, it's actually a <laughs> That's kind of a poor moment to showcase this item because Literally every enemy in this dungeon is very strong against magic. Okay, I keep forgetting where exactly you get the tip to, uh, to do this. Alright, back attack. Wait, throwing enemies 
somehow deals back raw damage? Oh my god, what have they done to the numbers in this? What the hell? Don't worry, that'll be fixed in the next patch. Like, somehow this game is buggier than the original. This is amazing. Queen's Diary. I have fallen in love with Odin. It is a forbidden love, I know, but the flames of passion will be not rule or reason. Every time I think of that noble man, my heart flutters and fans the flames yet more, and who could rightly fault it? When the fighting ends, I shall tell him I must. Uh, etc. Here we go, and a dragon nerd, the blue dragon. Tsunami! <laughs> I mean, there was still a bunch of little weird things going on under the hood here and there, but my, the more that we dig in detail, the more... Uh, the more that there's still a lot of work to do in this game. All the budget went in the music. The music ain't that good. I it mean, ain't all the budget good. There we go, learn Tsunami Zantetsuken, aka Scimitar. Four dragons lift. And there we go, even the queen was turned to stone. From the stone, is that a tear? Oh, these magicite surges with newfound power. Odin becomes Raiden. Oh, yeah, what does Raiden become? Plus two strength, and it teaches you quick. Personally, I think it's still worth it because a hey, quick is an infinitely better spell than Meteor. Especially since we have, you know, Haltzmo. It's like I maybe see the appeal of wanting like to uh Yeah, I see the appeal, huh? Oh, oh, that's right. Alright, it's time for a thousand needle to show its worth. Cause hey, that doesn't stop by reflect. I have a feeling that whenever I want to teach my people magic, I'm definitely gonna bring them here because hey. Yeah, you can also learn Meteor from Crusader, but the only problem is that hey, you learn Crusader so late in the game that it's almost not worth it. I guess it will be worth it if you were playing the GBA version. Nah, Meteor is essentially Ultima but less good. And that's all that it is.
It's like, uh, it's such a bad spell that whenever you get Crusader, somehow you can uh, learn it at, uh... Uh, oh no, I miss. Ah, shit. It's like the one moment in the game where having the Blizzard Orb is actually bad. Wait. Yeah, Meteor is Old Symbol. We have Old Symbol at home. Oh yeah, Crusader also gives Meltdown, which serves no purpose and will just get you killed. Okay, all right. <laughs> uh, did we win? Did we win? I sure don't know. The answer know. is no. Ah, yeah, that's right. You have to do this in order to leave. Uh, ah, that's right. These things have evaded. Probably should, uh, you know, use uh, attacks that uh, never miss. Yeah, like that. Oh, do they have fifty percent magic evade? <laughs> uh, I don't know. <laughs> oh, good, good info. I mean, I don't know the stats of these enemies by heart. <laughs> Fucking fake gamer over here. I mean, there's nothing wrong with being fake every once in a while. Fake by using the Yeti for the rest of the game. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, I'm probably gonna bring the Yeti to Kefka's Tower, so he will be contributing. Good, 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 good. He's just not, a, you know, gonna be a key contributor. Oblivion! Better than Skyrim! Ah, there we go! Fyro, Blizzago, Tundago! The whole fuck is finally ahead of everyone! Did you know that Oblivion is not actually better than Skyrim? No, it totally Unfast. is. Like, I'm sorry, but... Uh, <laughs> no, it's not. No, it totally is better. How? How I'm, is it better? I mean, it's In more... what fucking way? It's it has more comedy value. If I wanted comedy, I'd watch a, I'd watch a YouTube video. Yeah, Where but uh, you can't funny, not comedy. play a bad video game. <laughs> <laughs> the character creator was funny, and then after that, it just got depressing. <laughs> Yeah, but what about, uh, you know, uh... We're not arguing if that's the best TES game, we're just arguing whether or not it's better than Skyrim. I mean, it's clearly not. Because <laughs> they're clearly the two at the bottom of the pile, Oblivion and Skyrim. <laughs> I'm just trying to determine which order. Alright, rest for a bit. So now what next? Oh yeah, we need to get Gogo. We also need to go find the Dirt Dragon. Or the Hurt Dragon. I forgot what his name is at this point. They just might as well call him the Guacamole Dragon. <gasps> yeah. 
Yeah, but, uh, you know, Oblivion was the beginning of the Jude Bro legacy by coming out on the Xbox 360. The Jude Bro legacy. All right, now what's gonna be your party? I know for sure we can bring Shadow because Triangular Island is gonna fucking murder him uh, like a fuck. Might as well just uh, bring. Alright, let's bring the fucking E team. And use a word. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, Blessinus exactly have it right. That's the problem with Skyrim, it's too competent. Y'all have had your brains melted by Bethesda games too much. That's your problem. <laughs> if the game is playable, why would you play it? <laughs> yeah, but that was the fun thing with the game. Like, uh, the fact that it didn't work was, like, the best part of it. I just want to hang out and have a good time. That's all. <laughs> A good time is for wimp psycho. Oh yeah, that's right. Let's see if this combination works. Black belt and master scroll. All right, ribbon, hero ring. No, because Fallout 76 was just boring ass crap. Like, it's not the same thing. Alright, first of all, we gotta prepare for the incoming flight. The Hurt Dragon means that people gotta float. It's no good, no good at all. Please go talk to the Impresario. Yep, there we go. There's a dragon sitting smack in the middle of my stage. What will I do? Yep, there he is. Now it's time to go wreck his shit. Ah, don't touch the wrong switch or you'll be in for a nasty surprise. I love nasty surprises. Oh no, that's, that's the wrong switch! All right, it's time for a different kind of show. Yeah, impresario, more like the depressario. <laughs> oh yeah, that's right. This fucker counter counter attacks everything you do with Holy Dust. So the Earth Dragon's just a dinosaur. Yeah. It's a dinosaur that casts Quake a whole bunch and does physical attacks that deal a shitload of damage. Jeez. I, I, just, I thought it doesn't seem to have wings, and I thought that was a prerequisite to be a dragon. Nah. He's just very good at, be at being terrestrial. It's a giant lizard then, isn't it? I mean, a lizard can be a giant dragon, it's like... If it has wings, yeah. <laughs> oh, alright. Yeah, it's a worm if it doesn't have wings. Okay, float. Yeah, use worm. I mean, the usual alternate spelling I give it is O-O-Z-E-Y-W-Y-R-M. So, yeah. Okay, alright, that was you, it. right? Oh. <laughs> Fucking rip. He hits hard, but that's about all that he does, and as long as you float, he can't hit you with Quake or Landslide. Then Magic Point, Magus Rod. Alright, three dragons left. Looks like you sa It looks like you saved the day for us again! Congratulations! I mean, he used it once, then I recasted Float. 
Oh yeah, that's right. Let's check out the rest of the features of the Opera House. There we go. That's my favorite switch. The dog switch. Alright, it's time to sing an opera. Oh, Doggo, where are you, Doggo? I need my meow mix, otherwise I'll be sad. Is your impression of me? No. It's okay. Like, why are the why are these people <laughs> here at this point? Oh. And yeah, well, in case that ripped. you want to go back down here again on the stage. Like, ooh! Oh no, I have stage fright! Ah! 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 <laughs> yeah, stop on him! Whew! These Philistines booed me. Yep. <laughs> I mean, the, the show kind of went downhill after the dragon got eviscerated. Oh yeah, that's right. What are our levels? I just need to check out... Oh, okay. I better not meet Doomgaze because if I meet it, uh, he's wiping out the three-fourth of my party. <laughs> But he first bid. Yeah, I remember this song from Undertale. I remember my meow mix. Meow 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 is that an FF6 song? No, it's a uh, it's a final Undertale. Because that wasn't the okay. I was it's a gonna final say, it wasn't Undertale the song. song. It definitely wasn't the Meow Mix song. Mm. Yeah, might as well start buying armor ahead of time in order to deal with uh, three, four, five, six. Okay. I need seven of these armor. Okay. Yeah, that's the rest of the... I mean, that's gonna be the party for the Triangle Island. And then I'll have to assemble my whole magic squad in order to take on... The fucking Fanatic Tower. Oh boy. But yeah, I'm bringing in my all-star cast for this because I remember Triangle Island actually being really fucking hard. Alright. Munch, munch, gobble, gobble. Yeah, if you bring Yuzieti to uh, to Fanatic Island, uh, he will uh, still fight. But the problem is that doesn't give you as big an advantage than you'd believe. Because most but you of should still do it. <laughs> All right, there we go. Everybody has been successfully eaten. Yeah, Zone Eater Billy. Right, I There you go, hi Ether, red jacket. Uh, cool. Ah, yeah, that's right. There we go, armor, armor that negates fire damage. No, it's Zone Seeker, not Zone Eater. That's uh, two completely different things.
Oh, M. Duskias. Leprechaun fucker, string conductors, anything else that rhymes? Yeah, these fuckos love to throw shit in your face, and therefore the... Oh, alright, whatever. Ah, Genji armor at long last. Alright, there we go, Genji armor. Ah, gotcha! Ah, magical brush. I got in before any of you. <laughs> Alright, come on, just move out of the way, Mr. Shit-ass Conductor. Okay, alright. Ah, fake mustache. It's time to elevate... Oh, Camry Workbook. All right, these fuckers, these the uh, people with two swords. Yep, that's what they do. Okay, so it works. My combination of uh, of uh, oh fuck. <laughs> <laughs> I didn't do it, but I was thinking about. It. <laughs> oh, I got full of timing, wizard man. <laughs> Okay, holy water. Full of bees. Oh, yeah, that's why I keep forgetting that there's somehow a, a, a safe point in this dungeon that's like four rooms. And that's probably because of this room. Oh. Another hero ring. Okay. Uh, ah, fuck. All right. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, at this point, I'm not comfortable enough to try and do the very delicate jumping off of shit. This looks like a fucking Star Tropics level. Uh, yeah, it kind of is. I mean, this dungeon is completely optional. Like, it's literally a secret area. Oh, yes! Another thunder shield! That's not a fun fact at all. That's a sad fact. And there we go. Man shrouded in strange clothing. Or perhaps it's a woman. Or perhaps it's not human at all. All right, so what is Gogo's name? I actually have nothing planned for him, so, huh. Ugh. Lady Gaga. Or... What? Oh. <laughs> what? <laughs> what? What? <laughs> 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 yeah, the best. You're a mimicry. Poker. <laughs> what? <laughs> <laughs> you could have just gone with poker face. That would have fit. <laughs> I prefer it this way. That's how she sings it. <laughs> Ah, fuck, to the, to Zombo Fucko. He got scared while saying his name. Pop, 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 It's a good, right, good poker face. Ah, fuck, it doesn't work. There we go, my master scroll! Look at fuck! <laughs> I'm literally gonna wipe out to these two fucking nerds because all they do is to fucking turn your part in zombies! <laughs> okay, holy water. Good thing we have 66 of these at this point.
Sorry, but so get... far my master scroll placement, you can debate against it. It's foolproof. I... Can we not? Is that? Are you sure? Yeah. Well, I'm gonna go get stabbed. All right, happy stabbings. Woohoo! I'll see you later. Yep, later. All right. There we go. This place is safe. Alright, uh, do I have... Nah, let's not bother sleep. Uh, uh, while I'm not gonna sleep there, let's at least, you know, save here in case that, again, I meet uh, the two sword fuckos that decide to turn my entire party into zombies. Because, hey, it's the rage. Oh, shambling corpse. Well, excuse me, I believe your proper name is Shambler. Oh yeah, what the hell? The, the offering does decrease the damage of his uh, bum rush. Okay, alright. I guess there is a, f um, a feeling to my plan then. I hate to admit it, but it's Alice the Truth. All right, it's all in the wrist. Yeah, that's how the... That's how offering is called. Oh, Kimmy Workbook. Because, hey, now we unequipped it and... Oh. Uh, okay. <laughs> the slowest of throws. <laughs> oh my god. Alright, leave. Now, did people in my party get levels? Nope. Not at all. It's like part of me as the final thing to do. I kind of want to try and fight Doom Gaze, but with this party, it's not fucking happening. <gasps> so hey, at the very least, I gotta go through a couple of encounters just to get every everyone off level 35 and uh, 40. There we go, the gentlest of monks. I got a feeler. All right, there we go. Who's Yeti? Level up. So we already got one problem solved, we only need two more levels to go. That Terra gets level 41 and uh, Beef McJones level 36. I know he's not gonna survive that, but hey, it was wishful thinking to want to at least cure the poison off. All right, only one level left. And let's waste our magic, because why not? <gasps> so now we only need, okay, one or two encounters and that should do it. So I don't know in which uh, universe you live, so that two party members is enough to take out Doom Gaze, but I think we'll need uh, to do a little better than that.
Yeah, FF14 told me I need a full raid. Okay, these things give a shitload of experience. Mug solo run level 35. At this point, I dare say level 35 is probably too low in order to do a. Uh, uh, like, I debate that uh, level uh, 35 is too low to do Kefka's Fortress. Oh, nice. So I don't know why this thing is a sprinter that sure doesn't look like a bird that can run. Ah, there we go, Ultimo! Alright, might as well give her ride in now because, hey, it's also gonna increase her strength. Alright, now it's time to play the good old fun game. Where is Doom Gaze? It's like Doom Gaze is literally that. It's like fighting Doom Gaze is just like eh, it takes 20 minutes to find him and probably two minutes of actual fighting him. At that point, I'm not even sure that I'm flying in the right orientation to hit uh, all of the possible uh, Doom Gazing Counter Square. I, I still wish that there was a way for you to, you know, actually choose when you encounter Doom Gaze. Like, you will be able to see him on the map. Because uh, he's still worth getting. You get plus 50 MP max whenever you level up, and you do learn Flare. Oh, okay, right above Albrook. What the fuck? Oh my goodness, now Ultimo looks ultimate. Hell yeah. Uh. Why did I do trance? I don't need to do trance. Alright, let's attack! It's totally time for the limit break! Oh no, fuck, he absorbs gold! Ah, god damn it. Well. Ah, no, flee. God damn it. Oh, whoops. <laughs> I don't think he could have soloed that. Like, I'm sorry, this guy still has something like 40,000 HP. But yeah, there I say the the bull the the bullet of my party right now for this is totally you know you we kind of sucks for this fight. And in fact, at the very least, let's remove his uh, his orb in order to replace it with the Gigas glove. All right, it's time to warm me. <laughs> Ooh, hee hoo ha ha, ching ching, what a what a big bang. Uh, oops. It's like I'm willing to bet that I probably could have beat him in, in one go if I replaced him with, say, uh, Shadow and that he throwed shit instead of uh, doing shitty ass attack because hey, Doom Gaze does have a non-significant amount of defense which means that if anything you need to hit him with attacks that ignore defense 
All right, with that said, now we're Cooly B. Well, Cool B them in one go. <laughs> 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 Alright, now it's time to take bets on which square of the world is Doomgaze at this time. This time I'm definitely set in order to hit all of the squares eventually. Yeah, I mean, bad pawns is like food. You need it to live. Alright, you'll encounter Doomgaze. Now! Okay, it was worth a try. I mean, could have worked. All right, how about now? Up oh, near Mobliz, okay. All right, Mobliz, north of Triangle Island. All right, let's see where the big Foco chooses to live. Triangle Island. We're gonna have a flyby over it eventually. Okay, alright. Come on, Mobliz. Ah. Come on, north of Triangle Island. Ah. Yep, sorry, I tried. But your doom gaze is in another castle. Yeah, more like dumb gaze. Like if I already had quick, that uh, that fight will be done well. Quick. <laughs> Oh yeah, that's right, Kolingen, uh, Mobliz, uh, that's totally the same town. Also, I'm fairly certain we already flew above Narsh, and sadly it was not there. So now that I'm looking at it, the northern western continent kind of looks like a dragon at the top. It's like it's literally just a mouth where the Colosseum is. Yep, the dragon's neck Colosseum. Yeah, just somehow it never occurred to me. I don't know, at this point I don't think it's the neck and more the mouth. And the two little highlands over, that's the high brows of the dragon. God, where the fuck is Doom Gaze? I swear we're about to do it, to pursue every square in the map, and somehow we haven't hit him. So far, every prediction has been uh, sadly uh, wrong. Watch as somehow he's gonna be back above uh, Hal Brook somehow. Just like, ah, oh, uh, this is where I live now. Alright. 
right, we're about to go over Narsh. Nope. Oh my god, I swear we've been over every fucking... Ah, okay. Now we move over to Tsen. Uh, with that said, however, when he does a body slam, it does ignore defense. So, okay, I stand corrected. Use Worm is an asset to the team. Ah, that's right, this fucker casts Dead, too. Alright, whatever, he's my least valuable party member. All right, there we go. Doomgaze is dead. Only took two tries. There we go. We get nothing. He's a, a piece of magic sight fell from that case more. There we go. Bam it. And the skies are now free of jerkwads. <laughs> I mean, I only said he's an asset. I didn't say he was the, the king or queen of the team. I mean, his value, his veritable value was to distract Doomgaze so that he decided to uh, leave all of my big damage dealer alive. No, I didn't do Cult Tower, and before I do it, I'm probably gonna grind off screen in order to uh, give everybody in the, spell, in the team, like, the spells in order to actually do it, so... If anything, that's gonna be the end for tonight's stream, but, uh, yeah... Hopefully by next stream we'll be able to finish the game, so... Yeah, at this point TikTok Yo is at the appropriate level to do Kefka Tower. Realm probably could do it as well. No, I'm sorry, uh, you uh, overly uh, underestimate Fanatic Tower. It's like, this is not a dungeon that can be done uh, trifled with. It's not a dungeon for your grandma or your grandpa, and besides, nobody in my team even knows a re-raise yet, which kind of is a big obstacle. I need somebody to uh, to be revived in my party after uh, Magic Master uh, decides to cast Ultimo on my whole party. Well, thank you, House of Anchor. Now, please come to your room and I'll make you some spaghetti. <laughs>